An official of the Nigerian Correctional Service, ENCOS has confirmed that, Peter Nwachuku, the husband and the suspected killer of the Ekwame gospel singer, Osinachi Nwachuku is still in Kuye prison against the speculations in some media that the suspect escaped when group of Boko Haram terrorists attacked the prison facility recently. Public Relations Officer of the Correctional Service, Federal Capital Territory, FCT, Command, Humphrey Chukwedo, said that when the story began to trend in the social media, he personally drove to the center where he met him, Peter, and spoke with him, according to Daily Sun News Media Report. I am just from there. I spoke with him. What you heard is not true. As I speak with you I am driving out of the prison. I spoke with him. So, it is not true he said. It would be recalled that a high court in the Federal Capital Territory, FCT, in Wuse had on June 3 remanded Peter and Wachuku to the Kuye Correctional Center, pending the hearing and determination of the homicide-related suit instituted against him by the Attorney General of the Federation, AGF. Osinachi, his wife died on April 8, 2022 and many of her colleagues had accused her husband of subjecting the deceased to domestic violence, leading to her death. Peter Nwachuku was alleged to have kicked Osinachi in the chest, leading to a blood clot that eventually killed her. The Islamic State-backed faction of Boko Haram, known as the Islamic State West Africa Province, ISWAP, had in a video claimed responsibility for the Kuye prison break. Official of Federal Government of Nigeria, said, 879 inmates escaped from the facility during the unfortunate attack. A total of 879 inmates escaped from the facility during the unfortunate attack. As at the time of this report, 443 have been recaptured, 551 inmates are currently in custody, 4 inmates dead and 16 inmates sustain various degrees of injuries and are being treated at the moment. However, efforts are ongoing to recapture all fleeing inmates, spokesperson for the Nigerian Correctional Service, ENCOS, Umar Abubakar, had said.